While analyzing Microsoft Analysis Services OLAP data, it is important to have a great visualization tool like Qubit Business Intelligence. Many users around the world find Qubit BI a fantastic tool to browse your OLAP cube data in grid view. Using chart analysis for a more visual approach allows users to quickly identify impact of the values and slice data of the interest. Within 2016, Qubit presented a new analysis type, decomposition analysis. It allows users to analyze data level by level, at the same time allowing users to change filtered values on any of the added dimension levels on the same view. If you prefer MDX statements, simply create a query that you can use on dashboard visualizations and share with other users. All analysis, MDX, and SQL queries you can use on the dashboard visualizations and KPI metrics. Process of creating dashboard is fun and straightforward with Qubit and its great drag and drop chart elements, quickly picking created content for the dashboard. New options in 2016 allow the user to fine-tune dashboard visuals, select what data you wish to see on categories and series, configure value labels, show trend and average line, pivot axes, color palettes, and many more. OLAP data on the dashboard can be sliced in place with drill option in multiple steps, allowing the user to change visualization chart. With every new Qubit BI release, more visualization types are available. All dashboards can be sliced using dashboard filters, slicing all dashboard charts that are based on same OLAP data source. Each dashboard tile could be exported in Excel or PDF file, or user could decide to continue with analysis in a full analysis grid or chart view. Create dashboard subscription to receive an email at scheduled time or add comments to share your thoughts with your colleagues that are authorized to see the same dashboard. For presentation purposes, run your dashboard as slides, which will iterate through all dashboard tiles in full screen view with preferred delay between slides. Visit www.qubit.com for more details and stay tuned for more news from Qubit.